And just like this. <laughs> okay, never mind. It's crazy that the answers nobody had I found when searching for myself. Let's toast to victory. Pick up your glass, show me love for once. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen out there in South Africa, every South African, black, white, and gray. You are now tuned in to Chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> uh, welcome, Chocolate with Buddha T, the Lord of the entire, the Lord of the instrument, the Lord of the chart, the Lord of the jig, the Lord of the mummy game, the Lord of the entire. That is me, my son Azero. Uh, this is Buddha T, Buddha Jomo, he'll be our ghost chap of the day. And here's our man of the moment who's gonna give us the highest chap of all time, Buddha Loot. Ah, how are you, sir? Fine, thanks. How, how are, you? are you? I love it. Love it. Yeah, we are here chopping it with Buddha tea. Welcome, everybody. This is high tea, yeah. Are you gonna spill the tea? Are you? <laughs> <laughs> you said you are a lot of the mummy game. Mm. Okay, yeah, yeah let's I leave see it. you're becoming a, you're becoming a very troublesome. Hold up, hold my phone. A lot of the chig, the lot of the mummy game. Gotcha, bitch. Okay, yeah, yeah let's I leave see it. You're becoming, a, you're becoming a very troublesome man. What's this inflation shit? Don't go. We were, we were crying in the morning about all. Uh, what was the initial cry? We were poor. Well, the guess, yes. yeah. <laughs> of course. The guess, young. Yeah. Well, did you see what you're driving also? Oh, but just in on a general level, it's going crazy, the I guess way. You know what? I, what is it doing to you? How are you are you feeling? It so yet? ever ever since I ever since I um, got the whip in like Feb or whatever, right? Mm -hmm. It came with like a half tank. Oh, so you haven't let it. I have not let it go down half tank. I took it as this is free gas. Mm. So my, my, my job per week, my win. my job per week is five clipper. That's all I have to, to make do. Sure you don't my my maintaining is five clipper. That's a lot. Imagine asking that of a regular South African five clipper a week. Mm. That's oh, crazy. It means no oh, man. Oh, if you put it that way. Mm. <laughs> This is skinny nigga do ball. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you are you are feeling comfortable in the way? You, Doug, you haven't felt any I'll lie to you, ne? pressure. Um I've never looked at prices. Ooh. You know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> like like when like when I go like for shopping for Raybos, I go get Raybos because I need Raybos. I'm the same, I won't lie. If I'm going to go get gas, I'm going to mm. get gas because I need gas. I, I've never been like, you are, it, it's this it, much. It, it, it was oh. this much, now it's this much, now mm. I spent this much last time. Because mm. that's how you get in the young, like mentally, because mm. now you are, you are you are now married to the idea that you spent 300 on 30 liters, now you are spending 400 on 30 mm. liters. Why are you looking? <laughs> you shouldn't have looked. <laughs> Why are you looking? <laughs> That's crazy. So you haven't felt it on any level. Like, okay, obviously it's not bothering you, but you can feel the difference. I don't know, bro. I also drive less. That's how that's how I also solved that situation. I'm like, oh, people are complaining, man. So for me not to complain, let me drive less. Oh, block party. That's crazy. Jomo? Uh 
Cause the cries, niggas were crying about bread, the cost of buying bread on the 20 rand. Mm. What else was going crazy? Johnny Bass, what else was the cry? There was something, there's something you told us that was crazy. What was, was the, that? Oh, I was saying that I saw a pamphlet from 2006. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it'll hurt you that. <laughs> you, you must never do such things, guys. Money changes, and don't forget, money is fake. It's like it's not real. So, and mm. on that pamphlet there was the wheat beans, which was eight ninety nine. Imagine, you're gonna hurt That's yourself. That's But now, now, but now, think, think, think about it this way: twenty rand back then, twenty rand now. Mm. Yeah, but and also like inflation. But 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 also like one cent of your mom buying whatever, and your all one cent. of this is inflation. It's the world's inflation. It's been inflating since. But to think we are where we are now is I kind say get used to the norm of whatever the wild. of whatever the time whatever the time is. Eh? So you just adjust. I think there's no other way. Otherwise, you're gonna cry. How are you? How are you living it? Because you. Did you not just uh, resign? Huh? Are you not a resigned man? You're like me. No, I'm a retired man. It's different. You're a resigned man. Oh yeah, I left the zone. Yeah. Mm. Ah, the streets take care of me, brother. They, they always did. That's how. That's what got me in there. Isn't it? <laughs> he said, "Hey, you're fire on the streets. Come out here and do it for us." And I said, "Ah, cool." Yeah. So you don't miss that salary at all? Nah. Well, put a little to live a nice life, huh? Um, nine years. Old. <laughs> to be quite fair, man, you're not feeling any pain. Like, to be quite fair, mm. leaving the, I kind of set myself up. Yeah, and maybe give us the the jewels of how you have now come to live this life. Oh, that so. you enjoy and oh yes, damn. Relax. <laughs> <laughs> that was a relax. Yo. Um, how have so you come to set yourself? What up I did, you? right? From 20 points, bro. Shit, are you? <laughs> you know, damn. Okay, <laughs> no. We'll close it out, boys. Okay, so one secret, ne? Mm. Um, I paid off the Cooper. Mm. Are you good with money in general? I think I can hold money, but I can spend mm. money too. But I don't you spend do it on run it. But I don't spend it on. But I don't spend it on stupid things. I've never. I've never spent more than two thousand in the club, or more than three thousand. Yeah, yeah. I've never been a club spending nigga. Yeah. So on like frivolous things now, nah. but like I owed on my car. Mm. See, they don't tell you these things when you buy a whip. Yeah. Hey, buy this car, it'll be nice. That whip got stolen. Ish. No insurance. So I wonder you were stolen on the no insurance. Mm. So I had 200,000 to pay. Off. <laughs> yeah. Oof. Mm. So you had the two? I ran it up. <laughs> hey, <I'm in> the- <laughs> I ran it up. Hey, I'm in your pockets right now in I this ran point. It up. Hey, you dropped but that too. That's what leaving that place helped me with, you know? Say so, I know. Oh, they had to Let catch me. you out? Yeah, they had to catch me out to leave. Yeah. You know? Oh. So I said, I ah, know. With this let me let me let me pay off my old debts. Okay, but would you say you have the the finance man jewels? Like on how do you? Uh, well, what is the what? What's the language that they use? Financial uh, financial management. literacy. <laughs> what's mm. your financial? Don't rent forever is my advice. You mm. know, I'm not renting. Oh, so, you're not renting. Yeah, if COVID comes again, my brother, I ain't going nowhere. Yeah, you know? no issues with the rent. Yeah, in the last COVID, I had issues because. The owner was like, yay. Oh, you had to go home then? I had to go home. I oh, paid. The issues were not. <laughs> and I didn't, and even, when, when COVID started, I, didn't even, I wasn't even at Sony. I was still yeah, that's the, before that job. Yeah, yeah, still in the yeah. streets. But the streets and still. And the streets still. Yeah, were. yeah. And so the streets love you like that. Doug, it's the, it's, it's, it's the place. Let's so. mm. oh. see if you have music that sells. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> There's always some sort of a check coming I mean, mm, from somewhere. Yeah. yeah, but also like when you make music, what the same promotion? Sam is healthy. Your same promotion is healthy, man. Risa, you're a catalog uh, nigga too. <laughs> Atrocious. I'm talking too much. Oh, never. You're a catalog nigga, so I'm sure your same bro dealing. But also, are... we did we did champion music in in lockdown, yeah. and then. We got we did some gig. Remember those like those gigs the way they say uh Lovely defense. The online gigs. Yeah, the online gigs. 
Ah, they paid something. And also, which online kids now? The the shims are oh, it was a shims oh. Well, the those type tilly. of shims. Tilly. Mm. 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 What is it? Something. Tilly kick at zone six. Pre recorded. Me oh, twenty five. Yeah. Glary got a bag. We held it. It was delicious. <laughs> you must hold it. You must whatever bag you get, you hold it. Or like you can you you kept on you kept yeah, hold you don't of spin it. it. You don't spin it recklessly. Also, you don't not a, a spender. Nah. I mean, that's the disease I have. That's the spending. Ooh. In a week, if I'm just chilling by myself, maybe I can spend down and food. That food, that's, that's like food because yeah. I don't cook. Well, I used to cook, but have you fallen off with the cooking? Ooh, mm. Steph. I'm. I think I'm a two-hour week man, and it's just reckless shit. I'm, well, not always just reckless shit, but obviously the gas is crazy. Oh, when you see, I'm not including the gas. And when you're outside, you know, you're going to get food, you're going to snack, maybe the chairs also. Sometimes you want to smoke the premium, so. <laughs> you see, I'm not even including the chairs. I'm not even including, I'm not including any of those. So that means those For things me, are in the, the week food. also. Oh, then, I, then I'm, I'm going it's up crazy. to like 2,000, 3,000. A sure. week? Yeah. That's crazy to live so, with. That's why I don't buy groceries, bro. Because it's also like... You're not a grocer, man? Yes, boys. So what? You just keep the cupboards fed. You just keep up with what you need. and Yeah. Uh, Come on, boys. Mm. Yeah. Hey, I just get the snacks. Oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> you didn't see it like you said it back. Oh shit, it's, you never you're in the lead. I'm not even looking at that. I'm pouring. It is good. Oh, <laughs> Fuck. That's crazy. And Bede, what are you doing? He did. He mm. didn't. Get that rebound. Finish that. Oh, I can't believe I was almost about to lose with. How <laughs> hmm. speak, Cindy? You're going to have to. Why? Because it's like. Yeah, let's get into the talking. Oh, sorry. We're gonna get there, guys. Okay. Yeah. The Thanks. game's almost done. We're gonna re. Yeah, we, we, yes, guys. Twenty seconds left. Let's go. All right. We're podding. We're podding. We're, okay. we're gonna. It's gonna grow the show. Go back. <sighs> Kyrie, stay in there. Let's go. What is it now? Also, the time. What's 20, happening? 20, 20 okay, seconds. that's fine. I'm okay with that. What were you telling me? You were telling us something. Oh, your, your week is three. That's where we were. <laughs> <laughs> now there's so much going on. Can't Fuck. focus now. <laughs> okay. Okay, but also tell us. You have to tell us, and okay, you want to focus strictly and then... There's 18 seconds left, brother. Oh no. No, not carry. From mm. what's your weekly spend looking like? Yeah, Jomo pod us there while <laughs> we are <laughs> <laughs> I don't to the line though. I don't actually spend a lot You don't move around then? Eh? I cook. And on the health man motion. You feel me? And <laughs> I've gotten, <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> I've gotten used to the to the walking even to pop the whip and actually just walk to home, to the gas station to get bread or whatever I need. Mm, the so, small little Yeah. So I think thing, that makes yeah? a difference, you know. So you spend your money on isn't it ballet, you know. What do you think the spend? regular everything man is going to? A family man? Yeah. A, a family man with kids any and wife. Any man, any man. Which Just, kind of a man? But a man who's a regular man who's not living like a delicious life. Because people live like, you know, people have money. I'm talking about people that don't have money. The people who didn't have money before it got this crazy. Mm. Hey, bro. They probably living on like groceries mm. and shit. You know what I mean? Like. <laughs> They probably live on like groceries, man. Like you gotta, you know, you know that one, once a month groceries. Mm. No, surely. I don't know. I can't talk for the I regular man. I think it's man. tough. I think it's tough for the regular man. I think they're going it's through a lot. Tough, but 
I think Sneak, it's so crazy to me. He can't relate, eh? <laughs> I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. It's so crazy. I'm trying to like get this convo in him. He I can't, can't relate. I can't. I can't. Groceries are how people live. <laughs> yes! You are the anomaly. You are the takeaways. You are the different one. That is so crazy for you to not be able to relate at all like this. I don't, so What's bruv. happening outside? I, I really don't. But that's that's a blessing you blessed. You're super blessed. And I, I and I always take that into account and I always mm. thank the Lord every day, you know. You're an appreciative man, yeah. yeah. And you're spiritual actually, no? Very Heavily. Highly. So God's taking care of you. Ah. You're highly flavored, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's a delicious life, man. But just, I mean, there's hard work that goes into it too, you know? Of o- course. When I think of like all the bros that I started with. You had to become this guy. Yeah, well, I mean, well, like my friend straight up admitted that, yo, while I was craving, while I was like sleeping, you were actually doing all the moves like when we were young, you know? Mm. And I was just relaxing with my mom's money, just relaxed and... Even like we went to varsity together with like Tepo. Mm. And I shouldn't have named you, but it's fine. Uh and you guys no longer cool. No, 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 we tied, bro. We tied, so we still tied. You why know? would you not wanna say his name? Um so we were in uh at, varsity? at, at, at UJ. Mm. Uh uh what do you call it in commune, right? Yeah. What the res motion? Commune. Commune. Oh, you guys were communing? Yeah. Where? Where did you commune? St. Sweden's in Marvel. Mm, I knew <laughs> the commune motion was going crazy at the time. <laughs> That's too much. I know the commune motion. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> That's a cool level, the commune motion. so freedom does things to kids, you know? Of course. So him, he, he decided, yo, more how I met your mother. Mm. And just keep it. And also me, I was like, yo, the school shoes. Yeah. Right? Mm. So what were you handling in the school then? I but downstairs, um, BSC, uh, computer science. Mm. But downstairs is a dude with, like CDJs. Like, mm. in the in the dungeon of that commune. I was there every day, like, yo, let's see. I even called Cap. Cap was the like my my first hip hop uh, DJ. Capital. Teacher. Yeah, yeah. Mm. He came one day, said that here's the lesson. And it was quick. Oh, you called him to come? Give yeah. you a... Um, oh, that's fire. How did you reach him? <laughs> did you... Uh, like, how did you... My best friend in high school, Fifi. That was his cousin. So I, I, I knew Cap. And Cap at that time was... Cap. Yes. Like DJ Capital. To be quite fair, man, I, I, I'd have to give it to Cap to slide me in the game. Ooh, you give him the tap? I have to. Shout out DJ yeah. Capital. Because from Keep there, it was, it was, yo, come to Sway. Here's Alicio. Oh, he fucked with you some more? Yeah, here's Olaf Damn. Sundays. Come play. Here's, here's for play media. Come play. Because I was like, Kev. coach, coach, I'm good now. Coach, I'm good. Throw Kev. me in. <laughs> Shut up, Kev. But you gave us slick. Also, like any other gigs he'd do like out of town, I'd follow him. Like if he's going to Devon, I say, yo, I'm coming, but I'm paying for myself. Mm. And let them know out there I want to play. So you decided when that you want to play? Um, I think in matric, we didn't have a social at my school, like no school socials, mm. private school, small kids. What school did you go to? Let's see uh, this, this unrelated thing, let's see where it's coming from. <laughs> 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 it's so unrelated thing, it's unrelated thing. Yeah, it's actually, what's that, what's that place called? Pez Valley, you know, you know Pez Valley? I'm not a Hollywood man. Oh, Pez Valley. Yeah. You know Pez Valley, no? Yeah, yeah. it's, it's, it's kind of trenches. It's, it's like right what next is, to... What are they boys. living there, Katya? Nah, it's uh, not really. It's, uh, she's in the trap. Ah, oh, Pez okay. Valley. I hear that. Yeah, I hear Pez, that. Pez Valley thinks they're cheese. Nah, dog. Yeah, yeah it's they, cheese. It, but it's that's the way he said it. Cheese in the trap. Okay, cool. Yeah, my father was rich. Yeah. Nah. Okay, I guess. I guess. Yeah, which year was this? What, when did you matriculate? Um, I think 2010. Mm. Mm. Yeah, because you're not so far behind us. Mm. So the social? So there was no one to organize it. There was no one to like DJ. There was no budget. There was no nothing. So, ish, okay. (laughs) 
we stayed at this commune. We stayed at another commune, like this boarding house, inverted commas, right? Mm. They told our parents, like, yo, it's safe, it's what, it's what, it's what. But the landlord out there was low key gangster. Mm. Yeah, he used to like chop things for us. Like, he just came back one day. Bafanabam, in Pateli Sound. A mixer, speakers, tops, everything, all like, oh, oh. <laughs> damn, computer, virtual DJ. That's how it started. Yeah. Not Wait, this is still in matric or this is in matric? Like, that's crazy. Living, I'm cribbing oh. I'm cribbing with three of my boys mm. in a house close to school. You are you feeling? Yo. You've been living, <laughs> <laughs> Yo. <laughs> <laughs> you been living <laughs> delicious for Just a me. long time. <laughs> Trust what? me, last day of school. You were living like that in high school? Last day of school, after school. The niggas calling the friends out there, come! I know you in there, come no, out! You are the nigga with the Zaza. I was a Zaza Lord. Damn, you are Zaza Lord. So, a crazy experience I can tell you about that that nigga put us through. It was a Wednesday. The or, same nigga who's the plug. Yeah, man. yeah, 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 the gangster nigga. It's mm-hmm. a Wednesday or Thursday. He says, Bafanabam, let's put me in fast. We're like, yeah, we're in pajamas. He says, yeah, come. I'm fine in the car. You've just bought a new Tez or whatever. I don't. I think, I don't know if you stole it. I don't know. <laughs> but we used to whip that shit to school, though. Mm. And he took us to my first time in a strip club. Or, do you know Diplo? That's not... That was Diplo. That was, that was, that was, <laughs> Choosing your words carefully. <laughs> Next year. Oh, whatever it was. But yeah. Anyway, the social, right? Yeah. <laughs> so we DJed the social the whole night, basically. Mm. And then from that grew. So how are you playing now at the social also? Have you played before? Is this your first time playing? What are you playing with? Computer, virtual DJ. The virtual, no? Mm. That's when Kilo the Song was hot. When it was? Kilo the Song. Oh, yeah, yeah. Not to boom, boom, boom. Oh, never mind. Yeah. No, not me. No. <laughs> anyway, I started DJing but shout house. Shout out to Kilo the Song. That is the boy. I also started DJing house, you know? Because mm. I loved house from. Oh, you started from there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. from. Okay. From young age. Yeah, but house really was yeah, the. Yeah, yeah. It was being a DJ, you came in mm. playing it's house. Had to. Yeah, that's the school of. Mm. I actually had a partner when I was DJing back in Marvel. What uh, did you all level? Yeah, some of them, some some I used to start with maps. Mm. Mm. Then we got caught out because we used to do some pre-recorded mixes. Do you know, do you know, do you know, do you know Boogie, um, uh, Lebang? The stylist? Yeah, Lebang. Lebang and Domino. They used to have SWAT end. No. SWAT parties. I remember, I remember, I remember the, the SWAT, the SWAT ends. parties. I remember the SWAT end. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. It was, the, it was for the youngins. Of course, where Stand. was the SWAT? Everyone where was the parties? Everywhere. It was a Hollywood handle, though. Mm, it was, mm. man. We used to get both that, that handle. Let's get some. Yo, I had the quarters out there with the... I would see you for crazy. Say, what's going on? You're not mixing. Damn. Say, what's going on? 25 minutes, one song. Damn. Hmm. Ish. <laughs> <laughs> and they had a young with that. Ah, uh, they didn't want us to play anymore. At that time, it was yeah. still serious. Because now they let the niggas do whatever. Yeah. 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 Or not? Um, hey, these days because other niggas play. I don't want to comment on that. <laughs> <laughs> these days, niggas is doing what they want to. Hmm. Mm. Why would you not want to comment? You are part of that life. You're a DJ so, man. So I think craftsmanship has just left a lot of things in the world. In general, no. Yeah, just yeah. a lot of things. In the world. I agree with that. Yeah. Definitely, in a lot of areas. So you niggas, okay, you jam the, the social, or do you want to now tell us when Cap is throwing you in, bitch, Jan? Oh, <laughs> so the next point of Cap's, you know? Cap with no Cap. Mm. He's a real one. Um, then one day he says he's going to the studio, because I saw like dimples, and like, okay, I only saw dimples. Mm. Like releasing a song, a DJ. Uh, obviously. Is it gonna be a young if we warm the tea during? We can warm the tea, no? Sorry, continue. Um, and by that time, I had started an event called 
uh, VSS at Liquid Chefs every Saturday. Mm. Um, okay. I remember the Liquid Chefs. <laughs> what year is this? <laughs> and the Liquid Chefs has rocked also at some stage of the game. You know, Liquid Chefs, there's some memories out there. Don't qu- quit playing. So, I think I met a lot of like industry brews there. Like TJ's yeah, wise, yeah. like I used to book like Cosmo, Hudson, Caps, Beats the... What year are you saying? This is definitely around that time. This is probably 16. This is probably 16, 15, 14. Mm. Yeah, Liquid Chefs has to be... What, 13, 12, 14? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Not even yeah. a 15. So maybe a fifteen like this. But. So Cap told me uh, he's also releasing a song soon. He's going to the studio with like Cypher. Mm. So I decided, hey, can I? Oh yeah, Cypher also has plugged niggas. I'm telling you. <laughs> Cause oh yes, continue. Sorry, continue. Um. So Cap was also like decent enough to like let me go to the studio with him. See what Cap. made Cap fuck with you. I'm a nice nigga, though. Yeah, 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 that's true. <laughs> that's true. It's easy to with you. Okay. Um, so I went to studio, met Cypher. I don't know. I forget. I forgot, I forgot whose session it was. But I was just a fly on the wall, you know? Mm. And I learned from Cap. I saw, oh, he brought bottles to the studio. He brought food he, he for the studio. The yeah, I learned the games. So, oh. He learned the game. Mm, okay, cool. Then and I the handles? Him, and I, ah, there was no handles. I just, no handles. It was his house. You know, still dating. Uh, when you were still with um, the lady. Yes. Yes, yes. yes. I remember that house. Yes. I've been there. So after the session, I was like, yo, I need to find myself out here. Say for your number. Mm. Ah, well, what does it take for me to get to, 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 like, just to come out here? Mm. Ah, I found out. They said, I oh, need some racks. You need about five bands at least. <laughs> mm, just to introduce yourself. At least five bands. I said, okay, cool. Then Cal will no way. I said, right, let me go run it up. <laughs> you had to. Let me go run it up. And I did. And then I called him, went to studio with like a friend of mine and another friend of mine, like Fifi and Kevy Kev. Maybe you know Kevy Kev. I know Kevy Kev. Kev. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. And uh, I know him even since back then. I've known him for a while. He's also been a nigga who's. Outside for he's been outside for a while, mm. just as a neighbor. And the initial song to like I do was like found and created that night. Which night? The same that, night. The same night I went with Kevin, Kevin, Fifi. Yeah. Oh, this is now another night from the cab night. Yeah, when I went you by went myself back now yeah. with your own crew. Yeah. Now you are the boy. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. And you lost the funny name, bro. Mm. That beat said. And the first thing you made was do that I do. That beat said speedster. Something. <coughs> and then he was going through <coughs> going through things. It was a speedster song. It was going it was going through things. I'm like, what is this one? So the speedster. Can you start. just pull it out? No, I don't he didn't he, he didn't want it, whatever, whatever. I said, oh, let's work on this one. Let's work on this one. Like, let's do things to this one. Mm. What would you like to happen? I'm like, yo, more quiet or more what? That's the, I think that's how I, I, I started producing without knowing that I was producing. Because mm, at mm, that time, mm. you're not really you're aware. Directing. Yeah, you're not really aware of what's really like going on. It's, it's just doing something like off of like natural mm. you know, occurrences. And then we had a hook, bro. That we like a do hook. And then who had the hook? Kev kept saying it, actually. Cause I didn't have any artist friends, bro. I was just Can't like, <laughs> you know. Mm. And then um, Saifo called me that day and said, "Yo, I played that song for 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 Questa, and he'd like to do it." I was like, "What for real?" I. Oh, so it, it had just been a Kevin Kev thing. So right time, him. right place, though. That's crazy. I mean, on the nights where you near us, did yeah, you just left that day. Kevin Kev yeah. hops, and then you guys just leave. Yeah, there was so no sense. Did you have a plan with what you wanted to do with the job? Bro, or? I'm just a young kid moving. Mm. Just you moving. Just, you were happy. You have a song, man. <laughs> also, me, I want a song. <laughs> that was just my, mm. you know. So when you called me, I said, Quest wants to do it. Yeah, I came to the studio and I came bearing gifts. Of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Watch all me. <laughs> and then you redid the hook, did the verse. And then, again, I don't know any artists. 
I was like, okay, what do I do with this half dance song? Mm. So again, from high school, I know, thank you. I know a friend of mine, Leander, uh, his brother is uh, Nguli, Late Flower. Mm. So oh, I say, yeah. yo, bro, can you maybe ask your brother to hop on the And then... Oh, you asked the brother? Yeah. I thought then, you were going to say the niggas plugged you. No, I asked the brother. The brother said, cool. He heard the song and said, fire. And... So everything just happened like that. Like... <laughs> Hey, God loves you. Why are you just spoiled like that in your life? Like, <laughs> what does that even mean? Stay true, bro. Mm. Mm. So you always been like, been, I guess though, I, I guess it's not something you learned just now, being who you are. Because that's, I guess that's what brought us close. Is that what brought us close? The realness? Yeah. With the convo I the think realness. it was. Because I came in with the vulnerability. I lead with vulnerability. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. You wouldn't say I opened you up. Pause. <laughs> That's atrocious. You wouldn't say. You wouldn't say. Oh, it's disgusting. <coughs> disgusting. Um, we were vulnerable with each other. You pause. <laughs> we were though. We were. And I think that also, and I think that I think I, we got close at a vulnerable time. Yeah, mostly. because of because of shorties. Yeah, we're going. Oh, I was going through it. Were you going through it? On I the could have been. Yeah, I think you were going through it. Too. I could have been. I was going through it at the time. But also, the music was therapy. Because uh, mm, that's when I was singing. Mm. That was after Jala, mm. and I had just gone through the breakup after Jala. Mm. So even the content and the music, I think in the, st- the studio sessions, mm. man, this is where the convos mm. came. <laughs> ah, so your mommy came lifestyle? Also now, do like I do, obviously. So you have an immediate hit, one for one. Hey, your life, like, okay. From charm. <laughs> and what mm. was that like? Um, Bro, I think looking at back now in retrospect, I'd say I quite handled it well, mm. you know, because I could have went crazy. I could have been something. And you didn't. That I would not like to become, you know, I could have become, I could have become, you know, hey, I'm the one. Hey, it's me. You know, I mm. could have been that guy. But yeah, yeah, you never been like that, really. Even but, though- but but <clears throat> it, it did take a toll on me, bro. Like uh, learning firsthand that people don't give a fuck about you. Um, and seeing it and living it on without, one level. With, with the, like people here to take from you people here to you know oh, yeah. all that shit that comes with the industry like no one tells you like, oh, like yeah, there's, yeah. there's no there's Learning no male the there's, no, there's, there's no male to say okay cool when you're famous deal with people like this hmm. when you when this happens do you you, you know and it's like you got to go through it yourself actually speak on that that's a beautiful Cause for me, and your parents don't know what you're going through. Your friends don't know what does. you're going through. Nobody does. I was about to go there. I was like, for me, that experience was crazy. Cause I also just found myself so uncomfortable with my life, and nobody understood what the hell I was going through. Mm. Like, mm. I felt like, hey, but if everybody, people close to me, like close people to me, I could tell they have no idea what's nah, going on. It's, it looks nice for you. Yeah, it just looks like. I, I didn't fuck with it. I don't fuck with the fame. I won't lie. Bro, so if you look at it of a, a glass of water, right? Mm. As an artist, you feel like you just keep doing this. You know, pouring out your heart in the music, pouring out your heart in conversation, pouring Oof. out you and, hey, let's take a photo. I, I don't feel like it, but cool. I must smile. I must laugh. Cool. Oh. No problem. I'll do it. I sign up for it, right? I'll do it. Right? I hate that, that but now that statement. as 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 you pour out the glass, it becomes empty, bro. Mm. You know, and if you don't have yeah. like proper things to fill you up, you're gonna lead to like drugs. You're gonna lead to like fake friendship. You're gonna lead to yes men. You're gonna lead to maybe even throwing your shit away, like throwing your career away mm. off of some stupid mistakes that you made. You know, what did you have to lean on? Uh, God think? and my mm. mom and my family. That's what kept you together. Yeah. And also, so God and, first, and yeah, God first. You come from a good family, yeah. 
Yeah, I cannot cap I, that. I, yeah. That's why you're so well balanced. Like that's why you're so level headed. That's why you were able to not lose yourself in that situation. Which I guess is what you're saying, actually. The fact that that's what you need. Because that's how I lost myself. I, I come from a broken home. Mm. So mm. I was just going off of whatever. Yeah, I'm just I'm outside. <laughs> mm. I'm just outside and smashes. Do you feel like outside, outside, outside going you, crazy? I'm going crazy. Do you feel like outside was filling you? Outside is at that time. Outside is all I had when I was a kid to outside of the things that were going on at home. So that's why I'm so good at outside. That's why I'm such a cool kid. Mm. Cause I started doing outside earlier than everybody else. Mm-hmm. Because that's, that's where it mattered for me. It was like, Hey, when I'm outside the queen, outside, they show me love. Mm-hmm. They love me outside. The so niggas, yes, the niggas want to be like me. Yeah, it did. Mm. And the girls, they, oh, the girls want to fuck me. You feel me? Excuse my French. Ish, but that thing is, but, but, but that thing is just so monotonous, man. You know? What thing? Uh, that whole life. It's, it's a little monotonous. Uh, it wasn't in, in school. Cause yeah, you're going school. through different levels. So sure. in high school, it was delicious. It was delicious. You feel I, me? I won't lie. I was also oh, I'm nice telling school. you. If you are the nigger in high school, there's nothing better in life. I'm going to say this on record. <laughs> <laughs> there is no better life to live than to have been cool in high school. Mm. They, oh, my goodness. Ish. That was the only time being cool actually really matters. Yeah, yeah. If you're still trying to be cool as a grown up. Mm. Ish. Ish. <laughs> we know why. <laughs> you weren't cool you in high school. You didn't get your chance when it was really that time. Yeah, well. So and, that's why you feel the, that's why you feel the pressure now and, and, too. And, 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 and you know it's it's actually like high key the same thing with like um all the men who spend uh money on like, you know, uh the shorties and like the club lifestyle and all that shit. You know yeah. what I mean? It's because you didn't get the chance to be cool. You didn't get the chance for shorties to like you. You didn't get the chance to do it for free. Mm. <laughs> You don't have the okay now. My let's not take that far, but yeah. it, it's, it's <laughs> 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 but you couldn't do it when it was free. Mm. I think that's the safest thing to say. But because, also because it was free then. I guess cool also was a currency. Cool mm. is a currency because now clout also is a currency. Because mm. now there's niggas who are getting it off of that, off of the clout, which is also atrocious. That's why I said craftsmanship is dead. Because if your cloud's good, it's, it's good enough. Then you're good to go. Yeah, you're good to go. Millions, million streams. That's crazy. It is this basketball game. So you came in and then hit some, you have a level head. You make a, what was your first album? Volume one. Enjoy album. What was on there? That's this, man. Mm. That's you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this nigga, man. What, how? So then from Do Like I Do. Wait, the musical background, you have to give it to us. Because you come in, you've got Do Like I Do. And also, that's your first album. That album is crazy. So I think, like, I just listened to... I'm not, I'm not going to say like, yo, I went to piano school and I was like, nah. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> of course. <laughs> nah. No. But I, I, my dad listened to jazz, mm. R&B. My mom listened to gospel. Mm. My, my cousin who I grew up with, uh, she's like two years older than me. So she's like my older sister. So she'd always like plug me with like music because she's, she's also a cool kid, right? Mm. Um, so new house, new R&B. And then me, because I was such a, like a nerd, uh, like I download every new hip hop album, like, you know, that's come out. Like, I just want to say it's cool. Yeah, I got it. Like new Jadakiss, yeah, yeah, got yeah. it. New Bow Wow, got so it. you were on the path. Snoop Dogg, mm. you, you heard the, the new one? Blue mm. Potion, got it. You know? Yeah, I definitely grew up like that as well. That's what mm. led me into the, into, I guess, becoming who I became as well. But so at the crib, it's jamming every day. Like your folks are, what are they like? Your parents, they... The time to just have it blasting on a daily. 
Yeah, What's my dad is. Out there? My mm. dad is, yeah. So the chairs is blasting on the, the chairs is blasting. And also me and my cousin were blasting. You niggas are blasting on your own. <laughs> yeah, right. because they bought uh, some they, they bought some nice sound there, so it was like, ah, it's just mm. us. And she blasts every day. So I, I think I got used to R and B a mm. lot. And I got used yeah, to I house. Had a, I had a an older sister, so that's why I caught the R and B bug. Mm. Mm. You know? But I mean, from creating to like I do, man. What was the next song? Was it life? <laughs> What's my next single? I don't know. Oh, I can't be life. If it's a life, I'm strangling you <laughs> right, right the fuck now. <laughs> no way, nigga. So even I am checked. Oh, you had a remix. Was it Mercy, ne? You did the so. remix first. Remix. Yeah. Oh yeah. Did, the you, remix did you do the, the remix main. immediately after you did, ne? Ah, uh, remix I did it after maybe a year. So you had singles after the. Hey man, also I'm gonna have to plug Nota, yeah, because. He was the one advising me. We have. I don't want us to ever be ashamed of giving yeah. notes on his debt. Yeah, because he 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 really did plug me as a kid, to bro. Be he was like, "Yo, put this thing on Tatafal host. Yo, promote this thing. Yo, mm. go do match. Yo, mm. shoot a video. Yo." I was just like, <laughs> "Okay." Okay, what next? Nota is right a lot, guys. I, I've said this. And then Nota went to Bradley at Sony and said, "This is hip hop kid. He can do it." He can be the first DJ to do things of hip hop. Then Bradley said, "Bring him." And then that's how the remix happened. <laughs> Bradley said, "I want the remix of this." You know. Mm-hmm. And then, how did I meet Tweezy? There's somewhere that I met Tweezy, mm-hmm. and that's how the next couple of songs came about. And then I just had a big relationship with Tweezy. And then, oh, that's who you made the first album with. Yeah, I remember. Yeah, yeah. And that's how like. Oh, that also was a good call because Tweezy, Tweezy on the executive production killed that album. That's why your album was so fire. Tweezy, we have to give you, you your show. Another now. one. Tweezy. We have to, yeah. Uh, oh, flex. But this is all still God blessing you. Like, you, you just, <laughs> you just given all the right all ingredients. The right tools. Yeah, all the ingredients are right. The timing is right. So, um, who decided on the Tweezy though? Me though. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah this good decision. Like maker. all the all talent, all talent calls are mine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I believe that. Like who you, to work with? You're, you're the producer. To, like, let me go to Cipher and not go to somewhere else. Mm. You know, because I know I've had good. Hey, this is the best place to be in right now. Okay. You know. So, what, did, <clears throat> what was the first John Chell did with Cheesy? <clears throat> what was the next single? Where's the album? Pull it out. Let's see. Because <clears throat> that album was crazy. I think the first single is was crazy. I think the first single was Mercy. Mm. Might be Mercy. Went off. Might be Mercy. Oh yeah, you know why? Because Ricky gave me the verse on Ooh, "To Like I Do," right? All right. And then, and then, and then, and, and then, while while it was still hot, mm. he gave me the. Nah, dog, it was life. I'm telling you. <laughs> no, not, not after. Not <laughs> after. Do like I do. Here's it. Here's it. After do like I do. <laughs> <laughs> Mercy and that came when I was rolling out the album. That's crazy. Yeah. In life was your second single. Yeah. Mm. Quite thought to hip hop. Because also then. I was, In life is a classic hip hop record, you know? I still play it's a classic to date. SA hip hop record. It let's, moves. Let's not get that fucking twisted. That's still WTF. The Mm. Oh, WTF, WTF. Yeah, I should be, so that way. Yeah, WTF and mm. Cool Cat. It was mm. insane. Yeah, your collaboration I had, to pay, I had to pay for that verse. The Cati verse? Yes. Yeah, Cati wasn't playing. And I took it out with grace. Yeah, Cati wasn't with playing. Grace. He's still not playing, actually. Cati is mm. not playing. Which I like this. that, talk. He takes his artistry, takes his artistry on, a, on another That's level. That's probably why I still don't have a guy. If this guy become more, but it's fine. But now also, That's crazy. The inspiration of what's happening around hip hop that time is crazy. Yeah, a lot was going on. Yeah, a lot was a lot going on. Was going yeah, on. Like it, it was, it was very easy to bounce off. Was on it was fire. very easy to bounce off all these energies because mm. everyone was doing something. Did Tweezy do it live? Yeah. Did it live? Ooh, Tweezy. So we heard the Kill Bill on the Future joint. Mm. That Tweezy. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I went to Tweezy and said, Tweezy, there's a Tweezy that we need. 
and you need to make and something. That was the signature <laughs> of the hit at that time. Exactly. Like, if you didn't have it, we kill Bill. And it actually did go. Tweezy, yo, that song went crazy. And then you guys sit down to, you gotta talk about, okay, talk about whatever you like, but at some stage, talk, talk about on it. Because <laughs> the first time I heard that record, I think, was the time I came to come do my verse. Oh, at the student for flexing because at first I, I only did the hook on the first session, and then you came yeah. back, and then out I did the verse. You niggas played me that song. Whoa! Oh, I think you niggas were mixing it when I got there. Mm. What's that for? With Trees, you know, at the studio in, in Sony. Sony. Mm. So, ish, Chicana, yo, gold. So, I think at that point, right, I had. Counted how many songs I have on the album, and I and I and I and I, I, I kind of knew that I need like an R and B something. And mm. when I gave that brief to Tweezy, I said like, let's not go like classic R and B, like super mm -hmm. slow. Yeah, because it you was know? a it's a hip hop, hip -hop album, R and B. Mm. You know, so you could say you could say we're ex exploring the trap soul. Without Trap knowing soul. it, mm. without knowing because it was before the men had coined it, mm. you know. Just you niggas were trap soling before Bryson Tiller. <laughs> I did, yes, indeed. I did. So, initially, on the joint, I wanted Shane Eagle and Shikaina. Oh, okay, yeah, so I, that's I, fire. So, so I, so I organized a session like that. Mm. Shane was there, Shikaina was there, and um. I think uh, on Shikano's way out, I think she had to go somewhere. Mm. Um, she laced that, that that hook. I just we should get we should just get on with it. Like mm. chop chop was the real thing. Mm. And then I, we kept that hook because there was nothing else. Just that hook. We should just get on. We said. Mm. Also, awesome. that was the only thing that was there on yeah. the first session. Yeah. Shane didn't do Shane anything. Shane did do something, but you know. Didn't really. Yeah. Okay. So then I said, oh, why don't you finish whatever this is? <laughs> I know it was to say on to Slicer, but. <laughs> mm, she was, was just about, giving it as an exit. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> you know, on my way out. The truth was heavy. <laughs> hey. You know and I mean? also her, she's a beast. Mm. She's a beast. And then we just worked over that song like couple, over a couple of sessions and Cypher came to help. I Cypher was actually a great help in like arranging that song. Mm. And like actually mixing the vocals and saying, yo, go up here, go down here. You know what I mean? Okay, yeah. yeah Cypher yeah. knows his shit. Yeah. And that's how that song came about, bro. But to know that it's going to be that big, I had no idea. I had no idea. Zero. I remember Zero. for me, Zero. after you guys, because uh, I think I asked you niggas to send me that joint. <laughs> I remember when I got to the crib, okay, Stanley, obviously I'm gonna jam niggas my shit. Yo, peep me, I went crazy out there on the flex. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm jamming the niggas. <laughs> Cause also I went stupid out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, one yeah, of yeah, my, yeah, yeah, that's yeah, one yeah, of my, yeah, 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 Oh, yeah. You had my comeback verse. Oh yeah, that was a first it was the Zinger first choice. Zinger verse. And Zinger was the first was the first time Zinger was being written into uh Yeah, that's why you yeah. fuckers misspelled it. it. Mm, it was Wasn't like G H A. <laughs> Who was it? Tubedicious. Uh, out there to Sony. Shout out to Tubedicious pictures. We appreciate <laughs> also him. you. Yeah, we do. He's just like done so much for the game. Yeah, yeah we hey, appreciate Tuba. you, Tubedicious. Tubedicious also did get him, but before we even talk about that legendary shit, also, this is not about me. But I was gonna say, <laughs> <laughs> I got to the crib, I'm jamming the niggas the shit. Was, yo, peep me, I went crazy and flexing. Obviously, we jamming, we going crazy. But I jammed it a couple of times. You already know. And then I'm like, immediately, like, yo. That's cool and everything, but check this shit out. <laughs> Yo! We jammed that song the whole night, nigga. We kept running that thing back. Now we rolling the jazz. No, it was the first of its kind. It's the convos here. Yeah, I was like, it's a new right. design. Made, Disney has made some other shit. It's a shit. new design. First of its kind. That, that song is crazy. That way. 
That song. And I think that's why it went off. Yeah, that's that's why it's, it's like the song fresh. that it is. Yeah, because it's fresh. It's like, hey, mm. what is that? You've done a lot of fresh shit. Cause so, do like I do is fresh. Yeah. E life fresh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like none of those things had been done before. Mm. Especially, Honest especially the trash. Mm. Cause niggas wouldn't trap like that in South Africa. Man. Nah, nah, they weren't. Yeah, you have the actual good quality trap. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, <that's, laughs> maybe let's put it like that, because some of the other trap, you know, wasn't really trapping. So then, how much more delicious does your life become? Keep telling us, give us the history. Uh, let me see what happens. Oh, volume one. Uh, as soon as I released the album, it was like the summer's already. And we were nominated. Father. Um, dog, they. you the first DJ with a, with the summer, yeah? Mm, For the album. Yeah. Yo. That's crazy. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, that's babe? insane. Yeah. You guys didn't want to give him a round of applause? That's atrocious. <laughs> <laughs> That's atrocious. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you, team. Hey, you know what's the crazy thing? Because that was crazy, though. I didn't, I, I didn't even get to go on stage to get my uh, award. Oh, you didn't collect it yourself? Uh, so you was, don't have the footage? I was still a small boy. They were playing me around with my tickets and stuff like that. And I was still getting in the venue and all mm. that. So funny thing is, when I'm walking in the actual, she kind of takes me and says, yo, they... Go, then, go get your what? Go and call I'm them. like, what? I must run from here to there. Not That's doing crazy. that. <laughs> Full sprint and just that thing of, no, 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 <laughs> no. Okay. okay. Ah, well. All right. right. <laughs> <laughs> the show must go on. Uh, but I went backstage with Peko. Mm. Mm. Oh, that is so dope. But so your first album, you get a summer. This is like people, this is musicians dream award. Like Fine. people who, you know, people who have cried and bled and, you know, blood, sweat and tears, I think is what they say for that thing. Mm. And you got it coming in. Ish. And even, that's just your life. That's okay to you. I wasn't even aiming. See, that's the thing. So, sometimes you, 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 you when you, you don't you, chase it. Yeah, when you don't chase things, you get them. When you chase things, you don't get them. When you don't chase mm. it, it becomes a bit smaller. Mm. But if you just focus on like, how you whooping me like this? <laughs> I'm looking. You, you party. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. So, okay. And then followed by that one, the hip hop award. Or the year after the same year or later in that year, I don't know. Mm. But also that You're the I, first I, DJ to get that. So now Capital, Speedstar, mm. who else was before you? The big uh, DJ. Or Dimples. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Dimples, milkshake. VG. You're not getting any energy from that outside. Well, Keep it truthful. <laughs> Keep it very truthful. <laughs> What's the energy like out there in the streets? The thing is, you can never stop what God has created, you know? <coughs> also, you were from the South. Yeah. Weren't you the, who else? Weren't you the first name from the South, maybe? Probably. So you're an outsider coming in here in this yeah. space. Coming in North. Who does kid? What is the energy saying? Well, you got to book me because I got the hardest song. Of course. You have no choice. No, this is of course. Yeah. And you, that was <laughs> if it wasn't for have, that, if it wasn't if it wasn't if it wasn't for that, mm. I'd probably be sidelined completely out. No, of course. Yes. Yeah. So I think though these totems that I collected helped me stay in the game. They helped you become if more. I didn't social. have them, I would have been sidelined. Yeah, because they can still act like they don't see you, even when you have the fire shit. Yeah, yeah, I've yeah. seen how they play these motherfuckers. <laughs> they play dirty. But it was all love between all these bros, yeah? Which bros? Like Cap, Speedy. We used to do yeah. like Turban Rage. Yeah. Speedstar, I remember him on your video. Um, even me on his video. We used to do each other's videos. You know? mm. It was and all love. Turban Rage. We used to always blom together. I used to go with Cap. I used to stay with Cap and, and Rage, you know? Mm. So, so who was the friction from? The friction was from maybe just powers at being. Which powers are these now? 
uh, the ones that don't want to see you go too far they, when they kept your success. So this is what industry folk. Yeah, you think. yeah, yeah. Like more behind the door shit. Mm. Than so all the DJs showed you love on some level. Ah, you lying to me right now, like this. <laughs> Lying to me like this out here, <coughs> bro. Look, I, I, I'm not gonna say I was. Drinking. You don't have to tell me who was doing what. I'm, I just want to talk about your experience. I'm not gonna say I'm, I was drinking beers with everybody. Yeah, cause you that's I mean? the, only, the only people I'd be drinking beers with is the niggas I came up with, you know mm. I mean? and whoever I'm with in terms of artistry. I also built a lot of friends and artists. You know. Yeah. So yeah, as the artists. I'll just fuck like with you. I, I've never really had like a side or a camp or anything like that. I've just been friends yeah. with everybody. So you've kept it clean. Yeah. So I, I don't. Re- I don't really think I can say. I, I, there's a section I can't go chill. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Even if I don't know you, it's cool. I'll come greet you, but you'll know who I am, though. Mm. You have access to everybody, literally. I'd like to. I. I don't, I don't know about that. Who can't you make music with? In the in the industry, who have you ever had a hard time having? Yeah, yeah. Getting somebody on a song. Yeah, yeah. I've had a hard time getting nasty on the song. Oh, nasty is tough for everybody. I guess that's. Yeah. I guess that's. Um, I think it's a mystique thing that he plays in that regard. I think he likes keeping his juice very to himself, and mm. you know. So that's, I think that's tough for everybody. I don't know, should we count that? Does it count? If it's tough for everyone, does it count? Because <laughs> it makes it tough for everyone. Or, so, or you want it to be tough for everyone and not you. <laughs> because that's what life has been. It's been delicious. <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> but, that's, that, but, but, but it's moments like those that make me realize that, you know. Mm, not but, with everyone. Okay, but besides but, but, that, but, 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 but like, with everyone, dude, like, whether I knew you or not, to be on my own, I, I just like DM you or call mm. you or source your number and phone you and ask. Yeah, because I also so, was just there with... All I, with, did, uh, all I ever did in this life was ask. Mm. Hey, can I be on my song? I also you, was you just like there you? with Stilo. He was supposed to be recording out there. And then you niggas were like, yo, come on. You know, asked. <laughs> you know? It's like, uh... <laughs> 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 for now? Uh, no. I was like, okay. But I had some crazy shit for you. You did. Some crazy shit. I didn't expect that shit. I didn't expect that shit. I didn't expect that shit. I walked away feeling like, what? Because even that hook was tough for me to give you. Because I was still going through a lot at the time. Yeah, you did say. I was still going through a lot. So even being creative was still tough. That's why that verse became the comeback verse. Because the shit I'd done before that wasn't still wasn't connecting really. That verse actually is what gave me the juice. Mm. Like to to feel like oh, actually I got it. I'm back well, out here. After, no? Yeah, get him came after that. Mm. That's the first time I felt like oh, okay, this juice is maybe still in here, still in this body somewhere. I just have to find it. I hear you. Mm. That was fire. I so, loved that. Uh, oh, who's next? It's me. <laughs> I'm trying to come back out here. I'm going through a lot. Mm. Yeah, you're always going through a lot, you. <laughs> <laughs> I've made. Because <laughs> now I just I just I just thought mm. about it. That's why I kind of zone. I'm like, oh, so in Jam Volume One, you when you came, you said I was going through something, and then that bears water mm. at my crib in during COVID. I was going Even through. this crave when mm. I moved up. <laughs> it's like, oh. I've managed to make life like tough for myself in a lot of ways, like in a lot of unnecessary ways. Just off of being naughty, like just mm. you know like growing up with the gun emotion. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is actually. The gun emotion and the daddy issues. Mm. Mm. That you mixture see, has been now, at- atrocious for my life. Now, after after Navy Black, ne? Mm. After Navy Black, um, I'm a, 
I'm just skipping straight to Navy Black. Yeah, go do whatever you like. After Navy Black, right? To release Navy Black. But making mm. Navy Black was cool. I had a lot of time with like Magua, you know? Mm-hmm. It was dope. But I, 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 okay, I'm not getting to that, but cool. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Don't be stingy. Nah, you know. Just give us, you but know. I, I would have loved to continue working with Tweezy. Mm. Oh yeah, you, you and Tweezy had some friction at the time. I remember that friction. Because mm, I was cool with Tweezy at that time. Yeah, and the friction was even over some... It was uh, uh, actually over something not real. Mm. Yeah. What was an ego shit? Yeah. Not even, not, not, not even bro. Not so even the, ego it, shit? It's, 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 it's more of a... He thinks I wasn't there for him. Mm. In yeah. what instance were you not As a friend. friend. When what was happening? When he was going through it. And I, you know. Oh, he felt like you kept it moving. Mm. Mm. But you had work to do. And that's the thing. Mm. I, I, Have I, you ever explained that to him? No, no, no. We eventually resolved it long ago, bro. We cool. Mm. Mm. Well, of course. Yeah, you guys are cool now again. But I mean, at that time, like... Um, does the egos not allowing... Mm. The truth to be seen, you know, on both ends. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> you were <laughs> <laughs> nah, 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 nah. <laughs> nah. Oh, so he was nah, uh, but it's cool, man. Like he me, was we, in a bad place. It happens. That's not a like, judgment. We humans, that happens, though, you yeah. know. We all go we through. We deal that. with things differently. Um, when I was going through things, I gave other people a tough time, and it was tough for other people to be around me. That mm. happens. You know, it happens. But it's cool. We created a, a beautiful relationship with Marco as well. Mm. Um, Marco as well. Then at that time, you deep in the quiet. Yeah. Now Marco. you deep in the quiet. You know now. why? Because I'm, mm. I'm, 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 I'm fresh off the hip hop, and it's like, yo, I need to do more, do like I do, because uh, I want to, uh, I want to get to a point where like I can play a set. You see, like I'm a piano set. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but imagine a set of quite um, so mm. you know what i mean like, okay that was yeah, the goal. Yeah. oh you want you know? so i'm like yo too. we need to be creating as much as we can mm. marazo was out there he knows on them Zongongo. he even made one himself and it's a relic and it's on mm. volume three you know yeah raza has them Zongongo in his blood he's always been from that cloth he was there around that time when those things were being invented mm. he's a part of when that sound was brewing he's a part of Spreading that around, so he's definitely from the cloth. He's got them. And I'm so going to still hip hop, quite the still hip hop. <sighs> I miss both. Yeah, the hip hop spin to to the quiet. Ah, 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 but uh, thing, I guess Marqua claims it. Yes, do you give it to him? So going. Yeah. Yeah. It's his now. Yeah. You come. Pioneer. I can say pioneer. Pioneer of the Zongongo. Mm. One of the pioneers. Because mm. yeah. there'll always be a couple. Yeah. 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 The sound brews like waves move around, vibes move around, mm. and things get created that way. I've seen it. I've been outside. I've been in the streets for a while. <laughs> I saw a lot of people come up. Like coming up at the time I came up, I saw a lot of people come up. Like a lot of the game, yeah. I saw them as as babies coming. Even you, I saw you as a baby coming in. <laughs> 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 Even you, I know you before you could walk. <laughs> you can't say. I'm a fighter, man. You can't say I'm a fighter, man. Okay, man. We are the brewers of the truth. Yeah, but I took a break of the Navy Black, though. Where did that come from? It came from um, now this cup that I spoke about being empty. Mm. You know, you had poured out a lot at that time because I was too busy. I was too on. You went back to back with these two albums. Yeah, right? and uh, stayed busy. Too many shows. Too many this. Too many. But on volume mm. one, I shot eight music videos. Yo. And also, Yo. that's crazy. You're one also, of the first people also to do shit like that. Yeah, and so one of the last movie. actually, because yes, don't eight. do that no more. Eight, eight. That's crazy, dude. Eight big budget videos. 
and they were big but you came in <laughs> you came in going crazy <laughs> i remember that wave i was like hey this kid is going crazy and they were hey. all fire yeah the visuals hey. the <laughs> visuals were all quality yeah mm-hmm. i had to take a break bro so what did you do in your break um also wait how did you realize you needed a break what told you you needed a break i wasn't having fun anymore Mm-hmm. With what? Just everything I was doing. It felt like it's an algorithm to me. Okay, explain that. Um, what was it feeling like? So, I think to 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 be fair, in in terms of production, I'd gotten to a point where maybe I was starting to get frustrated, like I want to press now. Because oh, you don't okay. get me, you don't get what I'm saying. Oh, niggas weren't hearing you. Yeah. Not fully. Enough. Yeah. It was, it was a, I, I was starting to just. I remember that cry. That's like you told me that when you started producing. Mm. You told me that's where it's coming from. I said, yo, ish. I'm not. Uh. And the thing is also, you can't tell a producer because I get a day the producer and you're not. So then it becomes an ego exactly. thing. What's it? I'm the one who knows. Exactly. <laughs> I hate when producers do you that. You know what thing. I mean? So I think. My soul was disturbed by that. And then I, mm. I, I, I knew inside me that, yo, you can do this too. If you can speak the language, surely you can press it. You know? That's, so, it's crazy for me f- when you say that because now I'm looking at the relationships with the producers that you have done the albums with. Because mm. now it's telling me you're having those issues with, uh, with those gentlemen. Nah, I, th- I think that's just a... Uh, general thing like if you Mm. kind of specific i was getting too specific in my explaining Mm. you wanted specific things to come out i was getting too specific Mm. so it was like hey don't don't stress don't stress people with your specifics i know learn to press it yourself before you can stress yeah because niggas end up saying okay yes (laughs) okay play it okay play it (laughs) (laughs) no i okay i (laughs) It's fine, okay. <laughs> it's fine. Hey, the natives, hey, the producers, they don't play. You know? I then, also need to learn how to press now. I feel like that. It's like, ish. And then also sometimes they'll just send you a beat pack. You know? Mm. Like, yeah, I listen to these 10 beats and it's like, ish. I don't like that style because... Yeah, the beat pack style. Yeah, none of my songs come from a beat pack, man. Mm. You can. Mm. I believe in creation, like Ooh. stuff from scratch, Ooh. like mm. w- whatever the. Because usually, what happens with my songs? It's a cheat code. Um, I usually like envision what I want for a song. Like uh, I'll say, okay, Zinger's coming there. Hey, I wish you can talk that shit. Oh, that's crazy. And then I won't tell you. Mm. I won't tell you, but you'll mm-hmm. do it. Hmm. So, and you're the type to prepare a session also. Like you'll have the beats and you you're the you're a sneaky, you're a sneaky little nigga, actually. Just a vibe. Because you you play certain joints, you know. You <laughs> roll up you roll that's up your chair. Mm. <laughs> you roll up your chair, you spark the right chord for <laughs> spark the right conversation. And then play the right uh, starter songs. Mm, mm, mm. I, I, I I lead you listen the right to, way. Hey, listen to the man do this. <laughs> Cause I know all the session. That's why I ended up loving session. Which is like, hey, this nigga will just jam. Like, I'm like, so now who's this? Cause you introduced me to Roddy Rich, and Roddy is one of the ones. Like, he's a jam. Back oh, then, so when you played me that, I was like, what? Mm. Like, who's this nigga that going crazy like this? And others are saying, let's go this way. Oh, so let's go crazy <laughs> like this, please. <laughs> and now you've given me the tree. You know, you've, you're setting the ambience, also with the timing to say, okay, I've played enough of this. Now I'm going to play the beat that I want you on. And by that time, I'm cooked. I'm, <laughs> I'm at the right <laughs> temperature. <laughs> you're cold, cold. <laughs> by the time you play the beat, <laughs> by the time you play the beat, I'm saying, yes, I want it. Give me. <laughs> I want to kill it now, this thing. <laughs> 
<risos> aí depois, o que eu fiz ia ser, não. Yo, 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 yo. E depois... Era bom isso, falei, né? O que você precisa? Aí depois... Let's see marry you. Yeah. Nice. See the truth. <coughs> Because, so would because you, so I'm, that's I'm your secret I'm, take, I'm taking care of your energy. Mm, yes. You see, which I'm, is, I'm making sure that you're good. Mm, so you can take your goodness into the... So when I say, let's work. Yes, why not? Mm, you know? Now you are in the spirit. Yeah, not just when you walk in the door. What's good? Let's go to the studio. Who's <laughs> it? Come. Here's the piece. Because what's the energy already? It's, it's, it's you. Because already you're shocked. You're, I was too professional. What? You know, mm. so you're already tense. It's hella tense. Yeah. It's just the uh, pressure. This is what I need you here to do. You know what I mean? Please do it. It's not personal. Yeah, hey, yeah. Hey. If you could just get so straight to it also, you could have helped me. Mm. So that's how you make fire music. It's personal. Repeatedly. I'm intentional about what I want from the song mm. or the artist without telling you. That's a gift. Belief. That's a gift. When did you master that? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> what yeah. if it was then? <laughs> like I do. What if it was then? But mm. I didn't know. Or oh, you think it's been happening gradually? Yeah. yeah. But for you to see it in a, like this, from the spectrum of. But it was when I said I took a take break. care of the energy. It was when it was when I took. It was when it was when I took a break. Mm. Yeah, because I'd given way too much. Mm. I was depleted. So I had to first be honest with myself. But like, do you like yourself? What don't you like? Mm. Well, who, who are you? What are what you What were about? you going through? What made you question that? What didn't you like about yourself at that, at that moment? Because I know, I know having to ask yourself those questions. Uh, I've asked myself that. I think I, I think I did that because... Did that jet bend? Yeah, I think I did that because of failing relationships, bruv. Uh, yes, talk you know? about it. Because it's like... <laughs> talk about it. Because it's like everything everything else Please. is like working. Where's the... Hey man, at the Dubai. Mm. So it's like everything's After going well, second. right? Mm. I've got this, I've got that, I've got that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a shorty here, there's a shorty there. But mm. the thing is, I'm like... I've forever been just a loving guy. Mm. You know? So... Ish. If I have two relationship, I'll do it too well, you know. So I I I I can't get into a relationship just, mm. you know, because okay. I can end up change because oh. that's what some of the relationships had done to me Ish. already. Changing know? how now? Not really being about it. Mm, being like very. Hey, are you here to mess with me? Hey, what's your plan? You, or you protective of? I started becoming too protective. Because mm. they'd hurt you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because mm. that's where that would come from. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's, that's tough. So, Did you get hurt a lot or was it one specific one? Ah, you, know how it is with you, you know how it is with guys. We are very soft. Someone, a girl does one thing, you, you cry forever. But that's what I'm saying. Was it just one girl that hit you right there in that spot and it was like... It was ouch. the second time happening. So, like, oh, okay. so in, in high school, there was a show that I, I, I liked. Mm. And I was in grade eight, she was in grade ten, maybe, mm. or nine, right? Anyway, um, new kid, Valentine's already scored your biggest prize, <laughs> mm. <laughs> you know. So I thought, uh, but anyway, so scored how now in Valentine's? Oh, she was my date. Oh, she was your Valentine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Delicious. It's Valentine's February. You came to school January. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Oh, so you caught it early. <laughs> Great nine, ten, I said. <laughs> okay. So the level of uh, mm. anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Anyway, I'm hearing you. BBM or mix it mm. or what? Mix it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Slick came from there. Mm. Anyway, leave it. Mm. <laughs> also, the, the slick, the slick comes from there. His whole career. His whole career comes from mix it. Mm. That's where he bloomed. <laughs> ASL. <laughs> you know ASL. <laughs> Hey, ASL? <laughs> <laughs> you always mix it not. <laughs> okay, mix it anyway, not. Mm. That shorty, Valentine's, I bought her a gift. So I saw she was holding a, I saw she was holding a gift. The whole she takes the bus, I take the so bus. So you were moving like that early as a kid already yeah. buying gifts. Yeah. 
she took the bus, I took the bus. So I saw this present the whole day. I'm like, ha, on me was on nigga. So what did you get her? Uh, I don't know, some something chocolate, petty bears and shit. There was a pack. I was holding at it. A packet. Okay. Right. So after school, Candy Square, where all the schools meet. Now she's going to the NSA bros. And she gives she gives that lame mm. the gift to say, ah my guy. Bloody yeah, man. And I'm still here. I said, yo, mm. yo. Heartbreak in grade eight. That's so wait, wait, wait. She gave the proof the way you gave her? No. Oh, she. The one she had. I thought it was mine. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, he thought you guys were giving each other. <laughs> but after school, I watched her give another nigga. You thought it was mutual. <laughs> mm. Oh. Oh. Damn. You went on your knees. That was my first one to say, oh, girls, nah. It can be. Hey. And then the Playboy came out. Not like play- sorry. Mm. Not like that. But whatever. We hear you. We yeah. hear you. Mm. Yeah, yeah. We hear you. Yeah. And then Wait, later did you, on. Did you drop a tear on any level? I don't think so. I just hardened. It didn't drop. Nah. It wasn't that painful. It was just. I've never cried for a shorty. Ever? Nah. Mm. Come on, in this big age. Nah. Grew up on rap. All right. <laughs> 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 Okay, yeah. so then the second one? Um, now this was when maybe Black Times. This is you already DJ Snake. When? Uh, you don't deserve when, uh, it. When? You don't deserve it. <laughs> 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 this is the worst time to retrieve it. Anyway, so I. <laughs> sh- 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 I'm dating Shorty, who's like a manager on a cruise ship in like Australia. Mm. The shoe. I won't lie. When I, I, I pull out the drag. Yeah, I say it. Anyway. <laughs> um, you're holding a beast. If that's of what you A beast of a thing. I don't know if that's what you're saying. Okay, I'm saying you're holding a beast of a thing. She was beautiful, though. Beautiful yeah. soul, too. You know? Mm. So, anyway, we are chatting on a. We are chatting on a WhatsApp. Right? Because mm. on a boat, Wi-Fi, what, what, what. Right? Mm. So then she stops replying on the WhatsApp. Then, mm. she, then she replies on the Instagram. Damn. So I say, okay, why are we chatting on the Instagram? She says, no, 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 no. My WhatsApp is broken. I believed it. <laughs> a broken WhatsApp. I, and then even the, the text starts to slow down. On Instagram. The pace. Yeah, but also, I'm not going to act innocent. I was also uh, on my it's worst still behavior. Hurts, it's still hurts. On my worst behavior back in SA, mm. you know? Mm. But I think that was coming from a place of insecurity, though. Now that I analyze it. Because I could mm-hmm. sense that some shit went. Anyway. Then one day, this bro texts me and says, huh? She takes me. I say, what's going on? She says, no, no, no. Uh, sorry, there's this guy I'm dating here on ship. Uh, sorry. I was like, oh, okay. Uh, okay. 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 Uh, okay. <sighs> okay. <sighs> mm. Like that. <sighs> and the next day, this motherfucker DMs me through her account and says, yo, what y'all been doing when y'all start dating? I'm like, the nerve! You giving this nigga your phone to disrespect me? Don't come and me. address me. Anyway, so I think those two sort of things mm. kind of shaped, um, you know. So I just started be- being careful, like shorties, like. Because it's very easy for us to meet up, um, talk about our lives very quickly in 30 minutes. We can do a quick summary. Mm. And then you can say we had a moment, which we really didn't. And then <laughs> yeah. um, you're going to go on another date, but you just really want to bang. Yeah, you look at that. Both of y'all. Both of y'all. 
Loki no. just because gives him some time before the sex. You know, because no one wants to say let's fuck now. And then when you get into that, you realize that oh, that is gone, right? And then you're gonna cap through the next couple of months mm. trying to get in or out of each other's lives. Mm. Mm. You know what I mean? So mm. I decided I don't want to be part of those loops anymore, like all of those loops. Mm. So if any show you're trying to get it in, it's like yo, I gotta really see as a friend. It's gotta be. And when I say friend, it doesn't mean like. We have to be friends for 10 years because friendship just really means vulnerability, bro. Mm. You know, it just mm-hmm. means like Trust. I'm able to say whatever, whenever, mm. without you judging me. Be yourself. You know, mm. and like I can count on you for this, this and that and that and that, but you don't owe it to me either. Mm. So, ish. A lot of relationships be kept in the friendship, you know. It's no friendship. So this is what made you sit down? So, yeah. I was like, oh, I gotta fix all that. Mm. Uh, that's how I found all this. Because this now is fucking you up. Yes, I'm just like, whoa, it's whoa, got whoa, you whoa, fucked whoa. up. Where, 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 where are the mistakes? Oh. oh, so that's why you were no longer enjoying outside. <sighs> I wasn't enjoying outside. That's, <laughs> like, that's what the heartbreak does. The heartbreak yeah. is not playing with you. The same thing, but you eat the same exact food. This food was <laughs> delicious yesterday. It won't be today. Today, it is the most trash shit I've ever had. Mm. Just cause the Kiziolis is going no way. You know, the heartbreak is not the one. I don't fuck with it. Ah, I don't recommend it. But uh, at least, look, you, you choose. You, you choose. Do you want to drown or do you want to learn something from it and pick yourself up and move? Yeah? You always must learn and pick up and move. Yeah, because if you want to drown, that's also a choice, you know? And then... um. You're gonna say, no, my life is what? It's like, it's also a choice mm. to stay there. Hey, my life is yeah, bad. Yeah, Look yeah. at me. It's, wow, it's sad it's, for me. Why are you still there? Do yeah, some wow. thinking. Do some thinking. Figure it out. And after <clears> you figure it figure out, a way out, find a way out and find, like, maybe, like, what can you take from this? And how can it help you next time? How can you not find yourself in this position again? Mm. Is all the questions I've asked myself since that time. Yeah. And how do and you found, not, how do you not find yourself? In you those play back the tapes because people mm. don't play back the tapes, mm. and most often you are repeating the same thing, just a different background. Mm. You know, same. Oh, per- wait, say that again. <laughs> you, most mm. most often you are repeating the same thing, just a different background. Mm. So if you're going through that loop, like I just said, yeah, just the loop, now, yeah. It may be just someone different, maybe someone who's got different personality. But the maybe, loop is the same. But the loop is the same. Yeah, because it's cap. Because you're not it's learning. It's a cap loop. The, it's a mm. cap loop. Mm. I feel you. I, <laughs> you know I, I hear you. So if you ever in a cap loop, you need to get the fuck out. You need to find some truth. If there's ever a moment where you are doing something and you are having an opposite thought, that's that opposite thought is very true. That's your soul talking to you. You just decided mm. to not listen to it. You're thinking it's a thought. It's not a thought. Mm. Your brain can play tricks with you. Your brain is a computer. That's how computers are made. They yeah. copied the brain. Your soul is... Your brain already Your soul and your brain... You don't know, you know. It's two different things. It can be one thing if you want to be in unison, but... So, what did you walk away with from the breakup? What did you work on? Mm. On your break, during your break? What were you working on? She said, uh, I'm not sure who said I was selfish, so. I've gotten the selfish. Also. Yeah, I, 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 I kind of know it not really to be true because of uh, I know myself, right? But I just want to like explore that. You know, mm. and Sometimes see. It's, cause, it's not because you're selfish, but you may have selfish ways. Mm. And without understanding that dad is selfish. That's what I learned mm. from because I also had felt the same way and people so, told me I was selfish. I was like, so here's, I know me. Here's I'm the other not. thing, right? Um, I get it says, um, love yourself, love your neighbor. So what we do a lot these days is we tend to, you know, we, I want to put all my emotions on you. Like, you must carry them. It's like, yeah. no, 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 no. We do, do deal that your own shit. I'll deal my own shit. Mm. If I feel like this is going to pazamisa me in the next couple of, if I, if, if going there is pazamisa me, I, I'm not going to go there. If you're going to call it selfish, that's on you. Everybody should ne? be dealing. But for this. me and for my life, because you should also, you should also be dealing with your life. 
Don't be looking mm. at how I'm impacting your life. Hell yeah. How are you living your life? In in my life, I'm saying, yo, I don't want to go to this place today because yo, I have something to do tomorrow. And actually, I just don't feel like it. You know? Then you're mm. gonna guilt trip and say, ah, you don't come out anymore. Ah, 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 ah you're selfish. <laughs> but then when you say, let's go, I come for you. And like, yo, dog, you have a choice to say no as well, eh? Like, if and you have to say okay. no, I, I will never hold it to you, dog. It's okay. I take no, and I take it very well. Because I, I dish it out too. If I don't feel like doing I won't. I can't force myself to do something. If I say, if you say, ah, I want to come to you, and, and of course I'm, I'm heavy hearted, and now I'm just off of like crazy or whatever, whatever, whatever. And I'm not in the space to help you. I know I'm not in the space to mm. help you. Okay, I, can't I know I'm right not now. But I know that mm, if I if I sleep tonight, ne, mm. I can speak to Vlomo tomorrow morning though. I won't say no. Put it. I'll say no. Yeah. You let, know? Me, let me get you excited. Let, let me get you excited. I'll even come to you. I'll take you out. Mm. Then we'll talk. And also you will have come down more. You'll have more time to think anyway. Mm, there's no young. Yeah, you did that with me with the retirement, even. Yeah. You didn't say anything for like a month. Or but you know more. why? Because as, 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 as. You uh, were feeling away. I told you, then. Mm, you mm. told me. When you spoke about it, you were like, hey, I wasn't feeling okay. And I could feel the energy also. Mm. When I was chatting with mm-hmm. you, I even I told you, I'm like, the energy with the man is a bit, but okay. Nah, man. Because it's like, um, you made my producing kind of life or little short life amazing. Like you always told me like, yo, you're a genius. Yo, you're good. Yo, you what? So like, if I'm to lose that, it's like, you know what I mean? Mm. It's like, ah. But I never was going to stop giving you that though. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, come on. <laughs> I'm retired. It's like, I'll take, oh. <laughs> it's like, oh, this nigga's done with us. <laughs> <laughs> Closing shop. <laughs> no, I'm closing my shop. Everybody's, everybody else's stores can still work because a lot of people have come to me with that same. Saudi said they had the same conversation with me. A lot of the niggas have had the same conversation with me. Like, yo, we need you. What do you mean? And to be honest, I hadn't thought about that when I retired. I was that was a selfish move. It was based on me and how but I was that's feeling. that's why I didn't call you and call you out. Because as your friend, I understood that, oh, whatever this man is doing, it's, it's for his good. Like, mm. And I must respect that. And it's done me good. <laughs> it has done me. <laughs> Look at my skin. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had skin like this since I was in high school. <laughs> 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 It's fucking music industry. Oh. You see? Now I'm, you know, what a whole of a thing. Oh, man. I, we love it, is it? But we love it. It's when you yeah. love your bitch, man. You gotta live with it. What are you gonna do? <laughs> what are you gonna do, man? You gotta wife her as she is, but you figure yeah. out how to live around it. I don't recommend it, but that's how we live with it. And also, you beg on your wifey gate, so. I'm a wifey dub nigga, but that's my style. That's how I move. Yeah, thank you, babe. Lifestyle, I need let's, it. Let's and it's not, coming soon. Let's not ever get that twisted. I'm let's, calling it. Uh, I call this Alpha. I'm, I'm, I, I can call Alpha, but I can't call a shorty. Come on! <laughs> yeah, let's talk about that, actually. I've, I've known you for a couple of years now on a close range level, and you've been looking for that for a while. That was crazy. I found, found something that I wrote in like 2016. Mm. Uh, just a long shot of it says. Um, Are we making I too much smoke? No, no. It's fine. About the smoke. <laughs> okay. It says, I will never stop looking for my diamond. No matter what it takes. Because mm-hmm. mm. I, I already knew that, oh, it's going to be tough. I said, I know. Mm. I'll, oh, no, I'll, it's I'll, tough. Do you know why? To was, find the wife is tough. Because I stuck. That's another thing that we got to talk about because niggas think that thing is easy. It's not easy. To just find the right girl the and it's like, Someone oh, who's nah. real who does... Okay, let Yes. You, no, get into it. Chop it. Get nah. into it. <laughs> <laughs> get into it. Nah. It's, it's important. Come on, nah. them out. It's important. But, but, but okay, so I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just go on the basis of friendship, right? Yeah. So, friends... Nah. 
directed on the money game level. But it is. But like it's that. there, yes. But I'm saying because don't. okay, we can you can come to my house. Mm. We can we can talk, smoke, talk, game, drink, laugh, Make and you music. can go. Yo, hi, great. Mm. Ne? Mm-hmm. Which mommy game can you do that exactly with? Like a friend mommy game, like in real life. Like, do you have a friend? My girlfriend. Besides, we're girlfriend. like that. That's Besides. why she. Is, you see, is, yeah, we're like and that. And that's the only way that's why she you can be actually too. friends with a shorty. Yes. Yeah. Like, if you are going to be, you know, because yeah, be the difference, the difference is that using a long nigga, but you know. Sure. Yeah, no, you can't get it from me. <laughs> let's so put, let's put that on record. So, so uh. the friendship with the female is there's 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 so much like opportunities. Like you as yourself can grow, she can grow. Yes, you guys can create, Talk can about co-create. That. Mm. You know what I mean? There's things you can do, you know. But only if you choose your soulmate, bro. Because you Yo. guys have to understand each other. Mm. She has to understand the way you bring things and not judge it. And be okay with it. Mm. You're having but a know great how to communicate. Vice versa. Vice versa. Mm. You know? So I haven't felt like I've been understood on that level. It's always, it's, it's always like, Kwesha. having a great relationship with a woman will change your life. All the shit he's saying, mm. if you can have a, a relationship that you can stabilize Yo, with a that's female. The best. And then get the good that you receive from the feminine energy and a, a, a woman that loves you. It's both ways, yeah. Yeah, that's why yeah. You, you. That's why you have to love her. You mm. have to love her, yep, right? And you Not have to like. Yeah, that's you, what I'm saying. you have to love the friend in her. You have to like love, like. Oh, mm, I, I, I love being vulnerable. I love being able to tell you. I love. I can come to you and say, yo. I actually, yo. I yo, yeah. No, I love what you just brought up. Point. It just reminds me of, so I was watching another pod and niggas were talking about, uh, Bailey was talking about, niggas say they real niggas, but can't keep it real with their girl. What's it? it should be, if you're a real nigga, you gotta be a real nigga across board. You mm. can't be a real nigga My with case. your niggas, but you shy stay with your girl, then that means you're not a real nigga. You have to mm. be a real nigga throughout. That statement changed my life. I was like, yeah, because that's my nigga. You're like, your girl is your nigga. Mm. When I started looking at it like that, I was like, let me take care of my nigga. Once you start taking care of your nigga, your nigga going to take care of you. <laughs> let me put that on record also. <laughs> your nigga will take care of you. Find a girl that'll love you. That's the greatest advice I will give any see, man. I asked him which girl, like which girl is your best friend, and he said he should. Yeah, that's, that's that's one that's of my that's best, best only, friends in my life. That's the only answer. Not you need. as a girl, mm. as that's the only answer as a need. human. Mm, on a human level. Yeah, that's one of my best friends in my life. Like, that's my nigga. Put a, put aside the love shit because the the love shit is easy. Mm. So let's put all that aside. I used to have when whenever we'd argue in a relationship, I would always compartmentalize for her. Be like, yo, I understand what we're going through and I understand what you're feeling. But let's talk as people mm. and let's talk outside of girlfriend and boyfriend. Because mm. it, it removes pressure. Yeah, because also there's little rules and little mm. laws that, Love are, has that no have rules, nothing to so do with sh- anything. That bind us in those conversations. Also, you feel like you must play girlfriend and girlfriend has certain roles that she plays when we're fighting, when we are. And for me, it's like, nah, I don't give a fuck about that. I'm trying to talk to the human you. I'm trying to talk to my friend, yo. Not the society. This is not worth us going through mm. this shit for. Mm. Fuck that. Mm. You snap big. out of it. Hey. Yeah, you snap out of you it. See if you see, if you have that. Mm. That's but the thing. And, and as a leader, leader you gonna be gotta able to know engage. how to talk to women. That's also very crucial. That's something I feel like a lot of niggas lack. The communication factor. That that barrier it is, causes it, it is, trouble. It's, it's in daughter. Hmm? In daughter. What do you mean? It's I'm an in daughter. 
That's oh. the communication that, that, is that, that, atrocious on the daughter. I'm an daughter. It sounds like you're attacking Zulu niggas. What the hell? <laughs> nah, B, come on, man. It's just that thing of no, being a man. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. that, that thing of being a man mm. is to die for men. Yeah, it's toxic. That's, it is to that's, die that's the, that's for the toxic men. Mas- masculinity. You know? Mm. This thing of, hey, 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 talking about bullshit, not talking about really what eats you. Mm. Also needs to die. Mm. Yeah, the real nigga. Because you're gonna get to your friend and you you're gonna get to your nigga and be like, yo, talk about this and talk about last week and talk about this and talk about But back at the ranch, you're going through it. Okay. And you're not talking okay. to your okay. nigga. <laughs> and you're not talking to your nigga. And you're doing all this shit. Wasting time. Drinking, when you could be why, healing. Why? It's like, yo, you could be healing. Why can't you talk to your niggas? So I'm actively healing right now. Mm. I don't know how the conversation got here, but I'm actively healing right now and it feels amazing are niggas healing what are niggas doing out there in I'm also your healing. you are healing man yeah i know you i can I heal, see you i heal every year mm. i heal from previous conditioning because we're all conditioned mm. you know we're conditioned to think a certain way we're conditioned to feel certain and we ways condition ourselves also so i like what you said that because that, that's what healing is it's letting mm. go of that shit. Mm. It's not letting that shit build your new character. Mm. Build you know? a, write a new script. Yeah, yeah. because mm. I think at every stage of life, we're trying to really figure out who we are. Another reason I retired, mm. I wanted the space to write a new script. Mm. 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 At just at this stage of my life, mm. I just want to do some else. Shit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like mm-hmm. fuck y'all niggas. Mm-hmm. And this rap mm-hmm. shit and this industry and like the other day, so and last, you owe, and, and last you, week. You owe nothing to nobody, yeah? Nobody, nigga. Nobody. It's your life. Yeah, it's my fucking mm-hmm. life. I you should do be whatever. living your life. You should be living your life. You should be living your life. I should be living my life. Last I week remember. I'm in the club with Pori. So it's different when you when you're in the club in this space, it's different. It's a completely different experience. Because I don't give a fuck. Mm. About any of this politics, I don't mm. give a fuck. I'm standing about here. I'm not standing any here. of it. Like, so I'm just having a good time. Like this whole bullshit of people that there's, you know, there'll be those people who feel like maybe they might be a bit too famous right now to dab you. Don't know if you, do, oh. do you really deserve the dab or no. Like watching all those interactions and just feeling like. <laughs> You guys, this game, you guys really play it. This game, you guys take it seriously. You guys live like this. You come here and you give each other fake dabs based on how many likes you got yesterday on the gram. Bro, that's mm. actually another reason why I actually just don't post on the gram. I just post stories for bookings and shit. But it's like, yo, bro, I'm not going to play this game here. Yeah. This one of now I must... Because you must maintain mm. it. The cool you kid started, corner. When you start it, you must maintain it. I'm way too grown to play the cool kid corner. Like, I've got a real life to build. You? <laughs> real life is happening. Like, to go play cool outside with other kids is it's just not that time of my life. I want to do legendary shit. I want to leave a legacy. I want to be the greatest of all time on a human level. My goal is Will Smith. That's, yo, that's far. Haven't even started acting yet. <laughs> <laughs> That's far. It's a long way. I'm busy rapping here in South Africa for these <laughs> atrocious listeners. <laughs> <laughs> they don't even get this shit, man. I'm wasting my fucking time. <laughs> Come on, life goes on. Yeah. You just have to get out of certain trances and just be like, so what the fuck? Remember we said earlier in the car that people aren't listening to the music because you don't like Drake's album right now, but the content is actually pretty much the same. And if you're looking for some sort of relatability or some toxic relationship guidance or some shit, <laughs> you know, you'll get it out there in this new album, you know? Yeah. But you don't like the background music. It's still the Drake album. You don't like you don't you don't like the boom boom boom. So you can't listen now. The EB is a bitch. So what are you really listening to then? But the Drake is going crazy. Let's keep it at being. I only bumped it today. Drake is going off. Look, I have my white boy bone, you know? Yeah. It's, it's heavy it's, in it's me. It's connecting. It's heavy in me because of the sound. It's connecting. 
But uh, connecting me now, we came up on the house. Mm. Like when house was going crazy, we were on it in PMP. We were throwing parties already. We were in high school, like at the peak of house music, 2004, yeah, 2005, 2006. Yeah, we were on it. Catch us so on the floor, suits. <laughs> I'm PMP. No, we'll it's not a question. It's not a question. So. It's not too foreign, but two black coffee is doing it. It's out there. It's mm. going crazy. You find the deliciousness. You know what I thought of? Which I think would be insane if those niggas go on tour together. I think that's going to happen, though. Oh! Mm. I think that's going to happen. That's going to be the craziest that's... tour of all time. That's one of the biggest DJs ever and the greatest of all time. Black coffee and Drake on tour. The not yo, it's a young. <laughs> it's so all Drake has to do is take along. They shutting down the world. Touring, oh, oh, already. They shutting. They both have told the world. They both on peak superstar level and individually. Crabby. All of it. They hold all. They've got the accolades. He's got the, the biggest. Landed. He's got the biggest totem in the world. Grammy. Yeah, I've got the biggest one. Hey, he's the greatest. He's the actual. And he's I'm rocking with the goat. I made him do me. <laughs> he's executive. Brought him to his he's, role. Because there's a reason why they said come executive. Because it's his. It's they his said, said, Yo, 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 yo. Let's show us how to play here. Mm. What does this machine do? Show us the black coffee. Yeah, as the lord of this place. Show us. Show us. Show us. Show us. Show show us, show us, show us, show us uh, Doc, show your tour. And he touched it. Yo, it sounds... Mm. The album is fire. On. And then niggas want to hate. And it's like, come on. I can hate you, it Can you not see the greatness? I hate it at first listen also. Mm. I hate it a little. It's because we didn't get it. To be honest, I hate it. Just because... Also, the surprise album got me. So I'm like, oh, and I'm a Drizzy stand. Mm-hmm. So, so you wanted something. So I was ready for the trick album. I'm ready to yeah, go crazy. give us scary hours. He's smart. I know. Yeah, he's going to give us something. Do, like, so just getting do, the house on the first listen. Do, I was like, he's do, kidding me. Do, I was like, that no has to be way, Drake. I was mad. Ever. He's getting the whole world talking about him. You're all mad. And then... He's gonna drop scary hours, but also, and then we're gonna like it because it's hip hop again. But also, this is what we gotta say. For me now that I've jammed the album, I've jammed the album. Now I know the album. The album is fire. So it's like the nerve of me to have thought the goat had got it wrong, cause he didn't. Like the album is actually fire. He got it right. He nailed it. And this is, I and guess, clearly I the too. sound. That's what I heard too. Cause Beyonce is also now hopping on that same wave, apparently. Fact check. Who's our fact check? Yeah, it is. Who um, bumped the Beyonce? Did anyone jam it? I didn't bump the Beyonce. I actually peeped it. Did you jam it? It's crazy. And it's the scoop of motion. You feel me? Mm-hmm. Scoop of nitrous. So the goat is right once again. Goat talk. It's the greatest of all time. Back to you. As our goals. Yeah. <laughs> The Our one goals. in the building. So now you're back in the music feeling like what? Yo, feeling like the greatest, bro. Because you came back after that break that you were talking about. So you come back, you make uh, what project? Champion music? Champion music. Uh, that was in your in return. Gi- uh, in Giant Volume 2. Volume 2 yeah, is we did what on the... Uh, Izol. 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 Yeah. Yeah. So I was very experimental with the production. I um I I started most of the beats and then um Yeah, you were heavy of, on the production. You know, heavy. so the, it was like my first you Yo, know, album. Like, like oh nice. Mm, mm. You know. Uh um, so you even on the production level, you were coming in the room and saying, I was thinking uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm like oh. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> okay, I hear you. <laughs> YouTube had paid off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I hear you. And then Champion Music. Oh, so from the album, right? Um, there was a song, Fresh Jig, with Champagne 69, McLaren 25. Yes. That was a random combo in my mad genius lab. Mm. Just, yeah, I think this would mm. work. Because literally, I took Powerful the boys' verse and I said, nah, I'm going to make it a hook. Nah. 
you come now. Nah. You're going too crazy. <laughs> You're knee deep in the in the lab, right? And then people fucked with McLaren um, 25's verses, and they fucked with that combo, mm. and then they linked, and then we did champion music, mm. but we did fresh take first. Mm-hmm. Oh, first take was the first song. First take was the first song, mm. first and take. we were coming fresh from where? I don't we know. We had just been in top of the year, top of the year, like yeah. January. That was the first verse I did that year. Yeah, that was my first verse. Then I called twenty five. Then I was like, nah, 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 nah. let me explore this. We we're kind of reliving, flexing. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> kind of, yeah, on some level. But there was that chance to drop before. My blood, ne? My blood. Oh, was that in our project or? Uh, that was just a EP yeah, yeah, it's like a little small EP. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. 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 that's when that's also the yeah. production. I was yeah, heavy, for me. That's heavy. when you yeah. took me to a different level. With the pro- I couldn't believe it. Even seeing you in real time, I was, wait, you made this beat. <laughs> <laughs> You hopped on this it's level. So He's on it. He's and then on it. to a level in to history say, since. And it's crazy, man. That's very crazy because that was like also one of my first few couple of not really first few couple of beats, but in that style. But mm. the bounce was yeah, yeah, it was the first of that. Mm. Yeah, champion music. If you want fuck, I let it go and do it. Do it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what was going on with me at that time. Uh, champion. Oh yeah, so I called the boys. I said, "Come to my house for a week. Let's see if you can do an EP quick." Ah, uh, they came through like a Monday, Tuesday. They left on like a Friday, I think. Mm. And we did like five songs. And then I was like, I fuck it. I'm independent. I had like an di- independent. Uh, my kennel music was with Afrikori. Oh yeah, yeah. But I was still in a license with Sony, right? Mm. But I, somehow I managed, you know. You're doing your own business also at this stage. We must put this out there. <laughs> He is managing his own business. Oh, yeah. I always have been. Mm. That's respectable because you've done good business. That's why I say we must put that out there. Oh, thank you. You've done good business. Like, you've been clean the whole way. You've been, you've kept a good image. You've Mm. delivered music, Mm. good music. You've been on radio. Mm. Got singles. Yeah, you just... There's Delicious. no cry, yeah. There's no cry, like oh, but sick now. <laughs> no, there's just no cry. It's been clean, good business. It's clean cut, so you've done good business. Thank you, sir. Mm. Sorry, you. Um, I would drop that. Streets went crazy a little bit, just like the real streets, like you know the hip hop heads, the actual streets. Yeah, because piano was also coming up at that time. It was at its mm. peak, also, you mm. know. So, drop that. Um, then I started Sony like a couple of months after. So that. then you got hired at Sony. Yeah. As what now? You are uh, being hired because now you say <laughs> this guy will say that like. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Then I was at Sony. <laughs> like you are just in the room waiting for someone. <laughs> no, you got hired as there as what? Uh, the head of uh, A&R for hip hop and R and B. Mm. Mm. Executive. You guys again are yeah. not gonna give him a round of applause for, <laughs> yeah, come on. for that job. <laughs> for that job. Um so this this job, you getting this job clearly is a representation of the fact that people now respect and believe in your ear and your touch mm. as far as the space of music that you operate in. You mm. are being given a job in the label mm, to mm. come head how these things are going to be handled in the country mm. from this label. Yeah, yeah. That's not small time. <laughs> That's major. Right? That's major. That's mm. crazy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Put a loot to the greatest. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, so then you go to Sony. So I go to Sony. Mm. I was speaking 25k is having issues. He's about to drop Pele Machiavelli. Um, I said, let me try broker you a deal. Um, quite a good deal. Um, so you signed 25 to so I helped him. Here are the guys. He signed 25 to so I here are the guys, you know. Mm. And um I guess I was pretty much. That's a good sign. Yeah. Mm. Brilliant. Someone nominated. Brilliant. Someone nominated. Mm. Good call. 
So <laughs> the signing is now a good signing because the like si- the signing of you is a good signing because you've given us a good signing. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, reliable deliverables. Okay, we we'll see you. Um, yeah, then we helped like the rollout and the videos. I linked with Nate, has his mm. prayer. You so, were heavily involved in the twenty five. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then um, I think later, I think after a year, I was like, I, I, I haven't, I haven't like really been in the studio. Like, I, had, I didn't have songs. Like. I didn't have songs like to mm. say like, yo, I've been recording and these are like, this is my vault. My vault was empty. Mm. This was the first time in a while. Like, yo, my vault is empty. Like, I don't have anything to say. Hey, bah, here's a smash. And that was like, alarming. Mm, mm, <laughs> that was uncomfortable. That was alarming, you know? Mm. So in a way, I started losing a part of myself. Mm-hmm. Because I'm not really attending that man. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not attending the studio. Oh, the man, man is not doing his job. The man is not exercising. Mm. You know. That's, so that part of the body is. You know what I mean. Mm. But it's it's still, in terms of just the knowledge. But of course, of course. Come on, you but need the you need the, the muscle. Yeah, you know, the muscle you know? itself has to. Yeah. I think that's when we started doing uh, stuff with Nay, stuff with. Nadia. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's when we got active. Yeah, because yeah, then I started, started making. Active, I just started active. making beats for fun, and like I just. Mm. Then I met like. And then we were just making some yeah, making just, up sessions. Yeah, just like <laughs> just for fun, you know. Mm. I was just excited. And we muscle. made fire songs. Yeah. <laughs> fire songs. <laughs> you know. Um, then, um, I, I got into the mood of no, 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 no. Slick needs to come back. This is this is not me. But this this is not me. You know the playground. This is not me. I mm. <laughs> had enough no, fun. This is this is this is not me. You know. Mm-hmm. I mean, in grade nine, I made a decision to say I will never work a day in my life for someone. Grade nine, and I made sure. I oh, by this it. is not me. You're talking. You're referring to the Sony job. I said I will never work a job in my life, like mm. a job salary, like yeah. So mm. for me, even being there, mm. it was like a big, okay, this is not about me. Mm. Let me try, go see what I can do out there. And let me go see which doors I can open for who and however, and however God wants to use me out there, you know, mm-hmm. but I would have said no. Okay. If it was up to me. Konji, how long did you stay out there? A um, year? A year, a couple of months here, four or five months there. Mm. Mm. How did you feel working out there, though? What was the experience like? It was cool to see and learn the machine from the inside. Mm. Yeah, because I, I always, I always got to sit on the other side and, mm. and just I want, I want, I want. What was that like? The office perspective. Um, what did that teach you? It it, it taught me how I'm gonna run my business. Mm. Mm. Which is important. Yeah, that's important experience that you got out there. The you know, I actually went out there convincing myself like I was like yo let me just go out there to see how I can make Keno Music global mm-hmm. Keno mm-hmm. Music being your label yeah yes let me go learn let me go be a student in this corporate let me go see what's going on out there let me really see what happens you know learn absorb mm. help try do what I can do how I can do it you know no you you okay Come on. You chop it. You don't know how to multitask. <laughs> chop it. Chop, chop it. It's good at you. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> mm, keep rubbing up. Um, so yeah, man, I really love that experience. But now I kind of knew, you see, in Inja Volume 2, the first song was called Exit Plan, right? Mm. And Exit Plan was just uh, a, a kind Maybe of new like modus operandi that I had, like your exit plan is like your final plan of life, like how you see yourself in life later, you mm-hmm. know? And uh, I kind of knew that uh, this wouldn't last long, you know? The office job. <clears throat> yeah, so I, I, I got back to studio, did that joint of Blackie, Intentions. Yes, fire joint. Yeah. Blackie, you the boy. Um, and that was also like just the direction of where I'm going to go with like volume three, you know? 
Yeah. Sonically? Sonically, yeah. Yeah. Sonically, oh, okay. The direction. So you ex- okay. I was, yeah. I, was, I was starting. And that's like a a yellow Afro. So it's it's Afro quite bro. Afro quite mix. With fire. Mm-hmm. Love that sound. So I'm trying to explore. But there's a lot drum there on some level. Yeah, yeah. So we don't credit the Yano to that. It's quite the. The lock drum is quite. It's, what's it? What's the Yano quite? No? Okay. <laughs> yeah. <no. laughs> I hear you. I hear you. you. Know what I mean? mm. Um. Then the gig started picking up again, and then mm. I just kept consistency, and then I realized that okay, cool. If I can get this amount of gigs per month. Um, it'll outweigh my salary anyway, so I'm out. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. So the math was that simple. Yeah. And then you just said, "Guys, goodbye." Back in the streets. Like I never left. You live life that simply. <laughs> <laughs> Are you the greatest, guy? Eh? So now we just made champion music too, right? Mm. Yeah. Talk about that. That's crazy. So this time it didn't take one week with 25 Maglera. It took three weeks. Mm, thank you, sir. But Lovely. like a, a Tuesday to Friday, Tuesday to Friday, Tuesday to Friday. Mm. And um, yo, the convos are crazy. The music is nuts. <laughs> I think we found a new pocket for like hip-hop. There's a new champion level <sighs> on the champion music. I'll say We're going to be like giving out rings. Yeah. For the champions <laughs> on the fucking champion. Yeah, 25 is going crazy. <laughs> Maclera is going crazy. Uh, Blackie is going stupid. Blackie gave us two joints. He he did it. We sent him a joint. Mm. He did one in the morning. We called him, and then we said, "Yo, that shit's fire." And he's like, "What are you guys doing later?" Uh, like nothing. And he says, "Okay, I'm coming." Because mm, then I, with I linked up with him <laughs> in Midrand because I was with KO and he had a session with Blackie. Mm. Blackie was doing a song for KO for KO's new album. And then from there, they were like, yo, let's hit the slick. I was like, I was there just yesterday, but let's hear it. <laughs> let's hear he it. came to Lace Go Talk already. Hush, go talk. And then, you guys, so how does Blackie know Labamba? Does he have that song? How, how does he know that song? I have no idea. How does I have you know no that idea, song? but Blackie, I expected from him because musically, he's In yo, the he's a different nigga. So, I, nothing he'll know musically will surprise me because I feel like he's an alien at that. Mm. And to to be that, he'd have to consume different styles and different types of. It's like you, mm. like with me, I came in, I came up very hip hop. Like on a strictly level, like I came up a real nigga. It was a real nigga, young. Mm-hmm. I was doing the real nigga thing, young. So I was like, I fuck this other shit, fuck this shout, hip hop. So that's why even with the singing, like took me young. It was pouring, kept saying, yeah, that's a part. Mm-hmm. Sing though, <laughs> like yeah, I hear you, but <laughs> maybe, <Yourself. laughs> maybe sing that hand. He mm-hmm. kept. We kept being on me, and then I just was like, "Hey, let me just." And it's the greatest thing he's ever done for me as a musician. Opening that door. Say, say. Oh, it's like I'm in the Matrix when they open. Is that uh, Raza? You a good movie, Trust nigga? Me. The those little aliens that live in the locker. <clears throat> and then uh yeah, the oh. locker. yeah the locker they don't know it's a locker because it's their whole world in there oh that's not the matrix not the matrix <laughs> man in black yeah black sorry black. Yes. he likes will smith so much but he can't call this movie oh uh, don't Funny disrespect enough, will smith me turned down the thoughts of being real yeah. the he's the movie guy yeah. so yeah it kind of was like that when he when <coughs> i started singing it was it's like I opened the lock and there was like a whole world out there. I was like, what? Starting to play with the melody and it gave me so much more room on a creativity level. The songs now that I'm able to make and... Yeah, that's when I started. <laughs> that's when I started. <laughs> and, and got the whiz kid mm. feature. Yeah, too. 
the whiz kid and burn at the same see, time. You sleep on things like that. It's like, come on. So me and Tino, we, we, we push you. I'm the greatest. We, we, push you, we push you in that top 15, top 10 of classics. Because I continue that chat with, with, I'm with go. Tino. And we put sessions at the crib out there. Damn right. Yeah, I appreciate that. Now, I mean, my shit will, they'll probably respect my shit more when I die or whatever. That's when they'll really pay. Mm. I appreciate you now, bro. You do. Yeah. That's why we're friends. You do. (laughs) 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 Yo. Uh, that's, that's why real. I get the love. So, so now it's just really about um, proving that um, everything that happened wasn't because of anything else but God. Because yeah. I'm doing it independently yeah. and there's a plan, there's a vision, I'm patient. Mm. So I feel like all those years have built me mm. up for this now moment. Because mm. now it's like, yo, you got the funds, mm. you got the music. You got the vision. Mm, you know Take you can time. do it. Mm. You know what I mean? Do it. Mm. God. Mm. <laughs> mm. And when I start, it don't stop because mm. it's going to be champion music. Yeah, it, it it's going to be singles stop. from volume three. It's going to be volume three. It's going to be, you know what I mean? You got to then go. I can, I can somewhat relate because I feel like I'm at a similar place in my life where it's like, you know the whole thing now. Yeah. You were here. You've done it like this, you've done it like that, you did it like this, you got into this space, you got into this, because also my journey with the, being a writer and made music with Mafizolo and then, and then with, and with Pori and with KO and just all that experience is like. It's built up character. It's like, oh, okay. An experience. Now we're sitting at a place where it's like, okay. It's just me and God now. It's like, yes, now it's you and God. You know you can do it. You know you got it. Go get him. Same with the pod. That's how I decided to pod, I guess. And he's been talking about this since 2020 or, yeah. Last year. Nah, you've been talking about it since 2020. What? Having a pod. Podding. Podding. What, what pods already going up in 2010? I yeah, think on you, some. You're always just... Ah, I capture this conversation. Mm, been oh, on the like needing that. to mm. capture the convo level. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're, you're spot on. Yeah. Oh. People need to hear these convos. Yeah, because the convos, they, <laughs> they pick up. <laughs> 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 they pick up. I think so, that's why yeah. niggas even did that jig talk. Yeah. Interview it was, it was, board or yeah. inspired by things like that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. We were trying to... Yeah. Yeah, this would... Like now we'll oh, okay, now Every, we'll every idea starts as... And it, and that's that's what people don't have like patience. Patience for. to to grow mm. something. You know, because mm. ah, ah, it's been three years. I didn't. I still don't have a Bentley. <laughs> mm. It's like how like the the pressure. <laughs> Who you know got in your, one in, three in your years. dream that God gave you. You saw it, is it? So wait, you'll get it. Just that time is not now. Just wait. But there'll be a time where that time is now. Also, mm. I think it's important to say that the work that is most important is not the work that you do, but it's the work that you do on yourself. Yep. That is the actual journey. That's where the priority should lie on the, on what you wake up to do every day. Like what you are doing in the physical is just a part of, mm. but you need to be working on because that's where the actual progress comes from. Progressing there is how you progress in in the physical, I guess. In life. Mm. If you if you unlock the progress there by yourself, you unlock yeah, everything else. Yeah. Then it'll unlock. You'll see it unlock in your. Let go of the haters. There's no haters. Everyone got their own problems. No, that's a that's a. Made up, yeah. Mm. <laughs> that hater has his own problems at night. He's not thinking about you at night. He's not thinking about you anyway. No, he just hated on you for the, the for the moment. Yeah, <laughs> it, it, it was released. Oh, no, it was released. It was just released. <laughs> he doesn't hate you. He actually fucks when with he you. sees you. Mm. It was just a That's moment the on thing. the net. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Sorry. Fuck. Let me just jump on this man. 
Now you're gonna cry when are you in time? Then you stay with the young. Yeah, you 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 internalize it. And guess what? You mm. lost against yourself. Mm. But that's why also that fame game is not the game to play because it comes with all that garbage. That's why for me, I'm playing just the game, the human being game. But that's why, that's why my response to everything is, oh, oh, that, yeah, yeah. whatever. Yeah, yeah, so what are you talking yeah. about? Oh, that, 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 that. Since when do opinions even matter? I, I don't let that like determine who I am. Mm. I know who I am. I just, it's a totem. It's nice. It's a token of appreciation. You did some good work. Yeah, yeah even the achievements. Work. Yeah, even the good yeah. shit. Same, but now, if you want to take in, like, yo, energy. I'm the best, I'm the what, I'm the who, I'm the, you should listen to me, I'm, I'm, I'm. <laughs> You're not going to make it. <laughs> You're not going to make it. Yeah, it's toxic. This world is we, bro. Also, it, on everything Earth, is we, bro. In this world, you run into a wall. That's how life stops you, run into a wall. <laughs> it all comes at you at once. <laughs> Hits you here. Then you have to sit down for like 10 years, recover. Why? You were careless with yourself. Guess mm. what? Again, you lost to yourself. <laughs> how do you wanna, <laughs> <laughs> how do you wanna close us out to the news? Close us out. What, what would you like the world to take from you? We'll take it as a toast also. I just with, be real, man. With this water. It's very simple. Mm. And it takes a lot to, to, to be real. So just be real, man. Be real. That's all. Thank you. Thank you for chopping it with Buddha T. It's crazy that the answers nobody had I found when searching for myself. Let's toast to victory. Pick up your glass. Show some love. I'm more, yeah. Like, my energy is going, you know, like when Goku has that flame around. That's how I feel right now. Like, mm. That's how you're feeling. Yeah. Like, That's how good that convo was. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. It was. That was yeah. so sharp. We made a hit. We made a hit. We made a hit. We made a hit.